so guys this is about a cup of flour so i will just add a teaspoon of baking soda and then a teaspoon of yeast and then mix it so i'll mix it till everything like gets into each other so that's what you're seeing me do i'll mix it thoroughly so that everything then i'll now add please use clean your clean hands because i wash my hands already before mixing this because most definitely you need to keep your hands clean before you do things like this so guys i will keep mixing till i get the texture i want so this is what i'm doing as you can see so i will keep mixing 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 till i get so guys after doing that i cover it with a rubber and then i keep it at a warm place so after some time i go for it and then this is how it's, it will be looking i mix it with my pepper mixture of pepper and then onions and you can add whatever spices you want and that's it so guys you just go ahead to fry it and you are good to go so this is just me frying my pink so i hope you learned something new today don't forget to subscribe and then join the family and see you in my next one so guys when it stains brown i then flip it over so that the other side can cook too and then that's basically it so when it's done i just take it out of the oil and i fry the remaining ones so you can you and you can enjoy your pink so with with sugar or yaji or whatever you want to so that's just it my pink so is looking so yummy and it tastes yummy too so just try it and then tag me if you try this recipe thanks so much for watching i think this is the hundredth time i'm saying thing thanks so much for watching and then subscribe to my channel so i have my pink so looking all yummy